Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to be looking at some trucks. The Kraken trucks have finally arrived. Let's check them out. So it did come with this little note. It says, with your help, in addition to acquiring a set with incredible products, you also obtained a part of my dreams and my life. You helped make this project a reality, which until a few years ago had only been an idea. Now you will be part of the Kraken Fingerboard story and this story of my life, because this is only the beginning of something very big. Istar Solis. So that is really cool. And I did get the little box thingy. It's like ten dollars more or something like that i was like yeah i want my name engraved for ten dollars it was like this special edition thing there was like 120 of them something like that i i, I don't remember Ugh, i don't want to break the box well, i mean i'm probably gonna end up breaking it trying to get the trucks out oh no that's not what i wanted to do i accidentally ripped it hang on i gotta slow down Oh, well, I'll tape it. Like, a lot of these notes, well, actually, like, every single one of those notes, whether it's, like, you know, like a mess typed out thing or, like, a handwritten note, I do keep them all. So this is what the front looks like. I think it looks really cool. If it's too glary, I'm gonna... It looks like there's four screws holding the box together. So it'll get rid of all that glare um, when I take them out. And it does have a little tool with the hardware. And I see some washers there too. Let's not lose any of these pieces. All right, before we go to the trucks, we did get three stickers. There's this really cool Kraken that's blue and these two that say Kraken fingerboards. I don't know why I'm doing that. Got the bigger screwdriver. I think it looks really cool. I told them to put my YouTube channel name right there. So it's this really cool little plaque says Kraken Fingerboards and then he asked what you want engraved. I did put TC Jean and it does have the little Kraken logo. I think that is a really, really nice touch. So these trucks, they were held to the plaque with like this very thin metal that was tightly wrapped around uh, two of the holes on the truck. So they weren't going anywhere during shipping. So when I got them, of course, they looked really, really nice exactly how they're supposed to. And I just grabbed the knife and they were small enough or they were thin enough to just snap off. Yeah, I don't think anything was gonna happen. I tried using a chip clip to um, un untie it, it didn't work. So yeah, uh, the shipping or the, the packaging, like 10 out of 10. Like I don't think it gets any cooler than that. Very nice presentation, it, it looks super solid. Uh, what can I show the trucks on? We'll, we'll use the plaque. So here is the front and back of the Kraken trucks. And as you can see, they have a very unique shape to them. They're really like boxy, I, maybe edgy. I don't know how to put it, but they have like a flat side on top of the hanger right there. And it is an inverted kingpin. I don't know why I'm doing it like that. Like this, the same thing. I don't know. Look. Quiet. And I did get the chrome finish, or maybe it's the raw finish. I, I don't remember. There was silver and gold. It's probably silver is what it's called. So these trucks, oh, it was called the Founders Edition. This little package plaque engraving and all that stuff. Founders Edition, there was silver and gold. These are 34 millimeter trucks. They came stock with some red bushings. I don't know if it's always going to be the case, but just from moving it like this, these bushings are extremely soft. So we'll see how that goes. Um, it, they did include some washers in here, which I really, really appreciate, but we still might end up putting maybe a little bit harder of a bushing, depending how they feel. I will use it a little bit like stock the way it is. Um, and I did already pick stuff out and I went with a theme deck because I thought it'd be really fun to do. So we are using this pool shape beast pants. It is a feral, 34 millimeters wide. It's the pool shark. And for the wheels, I'm using some raw labs. They are the turbid waters. Of course, we'll be using the Kraken trucks. And for the tape, I thought it'd be fitting. We're using FBS. This is the C flip tape. So you see where I'm going with this? I thought it was great. I thought it was funny. So here's the board, all set up, quick breakdown. I think I am gonna put the washers on here in a bit.
but we are using beast pants. This is a feral mold, pool shape, uh, pool shark, see, eh, eh. Kraken trucks, turbid waters, and the C flip FBS engraved on top. I'm excited. I like this, this, uh, the theme of the deck, but, um, yeah, the trucks are definitely really, really loose. Let's put the washers on. However, just installing the trucks, and so far what I'm feeling, um, everything is machined very, very well. I know that these do come from Mexico, and the trucks, they just look really, really nice. I don't know why I'm talking during this part. I need to concentrate. I don't want to lose any pieces. These trucks have a very, very nice bushing squish. So I am gonna do some more testing with them. I'm gonna put different bushings, but just the way that the bushings sit inside the little, I don't know what you call it, the hanger cup. Wherever the bushings go, whatever that space is, the bushings stay right on there. There's none of that muffin top stuff going on, which I really, really appreciate. Yeah, that looks really, really nice. And grinding on them. Oh, that feels really good. Yeah, so Smiths, they feel fantastic. The Kingpin sits a really, really good amount underneath the hanger. So I am not feeling that Kingpin at all. Locking into Smith, Feeble, Switch nothing i'm not feeling that kingpin at all very very nice um i guess for i don't know reasons that didn't count there we go yeah these trucks they feel fantastic the weight on them they're definitely lighter than brts i would say they're close to dynamics as far as the weight goes when everything's fully set up but it, I don't know, I don't, I don't have a scale, so I can't weigh them at the moment. Uh, let's try some granite. Same thing. What else do I got around here? Plastic, I guess. Yeah, I figured. That was a no slide. Mm. Yeah, so far every surface, it, it feels great. Here's a better test for plastic. And some concrete. So yeah, my first impressions on these on these trucks, they are phenomenal trucks. They do take a while to get to you, but I mean, they he doesn't start making them pretty much until you order them. So that is to be expected, the shape on them. I really like them. I think that they sit very nice on the board. And like I said, that bushing squish, I, I, I really, really like it when the trucks don't have like that that muffin top but i am gonna try some different bushings um they are really nice actually right now i don't know i might not try different bushings they they feel great as is so now that the kraken trucks are here we are one step closer to the truck comparison video all that needs to happen now is for me just to actually sit down and film it Tool. But if you want to get a hold of these Kraken trucks, I'll have the link to their website as well as their Instagram down in the description below. So you can stay up to date with whatever they have going on. He does do them in like pre-order kind of things. So I guess whenever he's doing his next ones, you'll, you'll know, follow him on Instagram. A heads up, again, they will take a while to get to you. But yeah, that's, that's just how it is when it comes to the pre-orders but they are definitely worth the wait the little bit of time that i spent with them the first impressions outstanding job but that'll do it for this video and if you want to see more fingerboarding content give me a follow on instagram follow me or subscribe here on youtube tiktok if you want but 
Yeah, like I said, I kind of get around to that when I get around to it. Yeah, take it easy. Have a good one.